Good morning, you guys. It is Sunday. It is Mother's Day, and I'm going to surprise my mother-in-law at her church by going to Bible study in that church. I've been having a couple of technical difficulties. Excuse the quality of my camera that I tried to get back, and the source of things broke. So, um, yeah, so that has broken. And it said, girl, forget you. Then I had this tripod I just tried to use. It was like, girl, <laughs> you tried. And I've been having that one for a long time. So I am going to surprise my mother-in-law at her church. She um, goes to church faithfully. Like, she's the secretary. And when I was growing up, my great-grandmother was the secretary of my church. And my grandmother was the secretary of the church that I went to as a child, which I stopped going to probably in my ninth grade, eighth grade year. And like my mother and I attend churches, you know, when we want to go. But um, I think like after that experience, it was just a no-go. Churches are different. My great grandfather was the church pastor of the church that we went to, and my grandmother went to as a child. My great grandmother went to as a child, and that's how my grandmother met my grandfather. And this is I had to do the face mask this morning, but um, that's how they met each other by going to church. So we have been healthy residents of the church. But it was just crazy because once my grandmother became sick in 2011, 2012, um, they didn't visit her in her nursing home. They don't contact. Um, it's, it's a really, really bad vibe. Something is saying, girl, don't go to church. I still got to run a family dollar for one more card. Now, I was going to make this a bad bougie video, but I think we're going to have to wait on that. Ooh, white stuff on the corner of your mouths are gross. So, yeah. So, if you've been watching my channel, I usually keep in-house stuff on in-house things. And um, currently, as far as the in-laws, I love my mother-in-law. That's why I can't wait to see it. Like, the, the people that I have in my... Family such as mothers or my mother-in-law, my mother, my aunt, my grandmother, even though, you know, she doesn't talk now. She's 94. She talk when she want to talk and, and, and she go live at five when she wants to. And that's where I feel I get my dressing aesthetic from. My grandmother, um, she was always very, not the word cheap, but she was frugal when it came to funds because uh, my grandfather, who... I I came across this word and I was just like, it made me remind me of him. Y'all gonna be like Brittany for real? Yes. I was always his little hoochie mama. He used to call me his hoochie mama. I'm like, Papa, can I get $20 to go get? Y'all remember when you get a full set for $20? He'd be like, yeah, here you go, my little hoochie mama. I miss her. I do. Now, you know, being a hoochie mama is something. I follow this hoochie mama page. Like, they get it. They get it. They get it. So, um, my mother-in-law, my mom, my grandmother, and my aunt are the uh, people that I have in my family. Um, see, I'm rushing. As far as like, um, excuse me. As far as like um, with my family, my grandmother only had three children. Two of them are living and they each had two children, a boy and a girl. Um, I have one cousin who is kind of two years older than me i have another cousin who is right underneath me and then there's my brother so it is us four it is us four for my grandmother so we never had a big family she has siblings um which have gone on to to you know wherever they've been and she has one living brother who has one daughter and one grandchild. So as you can see, my family is very much not big. My husband's, that's a different story. His grandma had 
10 kids and she was a part of, I think, 16. So it's a totally different story when it comes to that. Um, I put powder on y'all. I ain't put no underline, under eye. But um, I have a small family. Um, if you like I said, if you've been watching my channel, you know I do not. Or you may not know, I don't care for Mother's Day. As a woman who has not even by the age of 40 dealt with a lot of experiences, no, never been touched or anything like that. But as far as pregnancy issues, I know that in God's time, Brittany is going to have her own children, but I'm not a fan of Mother's Day. Um, this is getting very um, interesting, but um, one year I actually had a mirrored carriage on Mother's Day weekend. And bringing that on to every Mother's Day. And, you know, I'm a teacher, so they're all my kids, but they're like, Miss Gage, you don't have kids, so I'll be your kid. <laughs> But I want you, but still, <laughs> still, y'all, I ain't got, ooh, these elbows is ashy. I'm using some suave skin solutions, some suave, some, ooh, what that girl said? What's this? She called it some, some, girl, I remember being in home ec in like the seventh, eighth grade, and she said that. And, um, like I was saying, my husband's family, they're a different story. Um, they're quite interesting. Um. I'll leave it at that part. But this year, I'm going to, I want to purchase a card for all of his um, aunts and, um, the, you know, the aunts. So, I'm trying to rush to Bible study because I don't want to stay for church because of other reasons. But um, as far as his particular family, you know, they're cool. They're awesome. But, um... I'm not a big fan of Mother's Day, but of course, I like to give gifts. Y'all, I have, I'm washing so many brushes right now. That, I mean, they're not, I mean, I'm not washing them, but they're drying. And so, I don't have nothing. I don't have a lot of my good brushes out. So, um, I'm not a big fan of Mother's Day. Um, I love the mothers who are able to experience it. I love you guys. I love the parents who may not never had to have children because they had so many nieces and nephews or they weren't able to conceive and they were able to, you know, be a parent to other kids, be in the neighborhood or your family. Um, I'm here for the mothers who have lost many, many, many children throughout the years who have maybe been alive or um, maybe you had a pregnancy where you keep, couldn't keep the child or, you know, things of that matter. I am here for every single mother in the year of 2024 since I want to say 27, 20, 27, 19. But um, I want, if, girl, I think I just, Put mascara on my on, on my olive, but I'm here for all the mothers. Um, it's Mother's Day, y'all, and I hope y'all enjoy it. Um, I got some new fret braids, but I'm gonna go into that in a different video. And um, I think I should have longer, but damn, you know when you start adding extras, shoot, that 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 amount be getting expensive. Who would have known if you wanted um. Bohemian, you gotta pay extra thirty dollars. I was watching videos on how to add curls to your uh <laughs> knotless braids. I was like, well, dang, I should have just got me some knotless braids. I know I got a crochet, crochet little piece or whatever, and I know I can work on it, honey. I know I can work on it. So uh, maybe should I add some more hair in? But it's bohemian. You're not supposed to have all that hair. Um, the lady who did my hair, she was like, that's called Bora Bora. Well, guess what? Y'all. 
The lady who did my hair was calling in. She said, you have bohemian. What you want is Bora Bora. So next time, a girl's getting Bora Bora. I mean, they are long. They're to my butt. But I be wanting them to sit down on them. I want to sit down on them. I want to sit down on them. So where it's like, girl... This is my, this is not the correct, it's not. Those are to put on individual lashes that I have tried unsuccessfully. But I'm going to give y'all a little vlog about my day. Because after I go to church, later on I'm going to my mom, oh my, my aunt, where my grandmother is going to be and um, my mom, I got her this little gift, of course, from AliExpress. Came with a watch and um, a watch, a bracelet, a ring, a necklace, probably all it. I don't know. Damn, y'all. What time is it? Okay, Brittany's late. And no matter how late you going to be, what you going to do? You going to spritz down their face. Spritz. You're going to spritz down their face. Their face. Now, what's the easiest earrings for me to put on right now? These are, but where's the other? These are, but where's the other? Are you serious? What if I just wear one Louis Vuitton earring? <laughs> I can't find the other one. Baby, what? I think that's what I'm going to do. Y'all like Brittany, really? Or maybe I should just, like, be different about it. Um, let me put on my little fake Van Cleef. Cleefs, because I got a few. These came from the 6R shop. They're already turning color. Um, yeah. Don't you want to be somewhere and be like, you're missing the earring. Girl, for real? I didn't even notice. That's what I'm doing today. So I'm going to change when I get back and get into my um, regular diggler outfit um, when I go to my aunt's house. So, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on.